What's up guys? Um, so I've been getting some questions on how to zero the offset on badger mounts or you know whatever you're running. Um, so I was gonna make a quick video about it. Gotta have some bags if you really wanna get uh, precise with it. So uh, this is just a, um, a brute force sandbag, like a workout bag, a kettlebell. And then I've got just a Amazon uh, shooter bag. And I'm gonna bag my stock and my forend here and get really stable. And I wanna make sure that the dot is zeroed in the vertical plane that it'll be on when I'm actually shooting it. Because I don't, I don't zero it like this, uh, simply because if I zero it like that and then I go to shoot it like that, everything changes with those angles. So let's get that thing bagged straight up and down. Um, I zero mine at 50 yards. And what I would like is to have these bags in such a position that there's no muscular input from me being applied to the gun in order to get this thing where I need it on target. Um, so I'm gonna set these bags up where it's pretty much just resting on the bags and I'm just working the trigger. Uh, you do that, you get minimal input to the gun. So uh, lock in behind it so it can't really move that much and then give yourself five rounds. And then we can go down, take a look at it, uh, and see you know where we need to move accordingly. But um, biggest things are make sure you're not putting anything into the gun. Make sure they're bagged up, um, get stable, man. Uh, shooting, shooting small groups, shooting distance, um, getting a really solid grouping so you know where to move it is all about getting set up properly.